Want to go time traveling with me? See, I built a time machine. This looks like your transmogrifier. To the inattentive and brainless layman, yes, but you crawl under the transmogrifier, whereas with the time machine, you climb in the top. Ah. Are we going to travel into the past or into the future? Well, I suppose if we went into the past, I could ace any upcoming history exams in school. That might be useful. But if we went into the future, we could swipe something and pretend to invent it when we got back. We could be rich. The future it is, Dan. Right. Once I'm rich, I can hire somebody to take all my dumb tests. Okay, Hobbs, our time machine is all set. Put on your goggles and we'll go off to the future. Why do we have to wear goggles? Jeez, do you think traveling years into the future is like driving down the street? We've got to contend with vortexes and light speeds. Anything could go wrong. Of course we need to wear goggles. Gosh, I think my goggles are in the bedroom. If I'm not back in a couple minutes, you can go without me. Sit down, sissy. I already got your goggles. Already? I'll just push the button and off we go into the future. Up, up, and away! We're approaching light speed, Hobbs. Hang on. I have to go to the bathroom. Now? In hyperspace? Are you crazy? What year in the future are we going to land? It's hard to pinpoint exactly, but I'd say sometime around the turn of the century. I hope old Earth is still around then. I've grown fond of it. If not, we'll return to the present and see if Dad will give me my college tuition early in cash. <laughs> Hang on, we're coming in! Screech! Wow, so this is the future. I kind of pictured more buildings. Maybe we landed in an arboretum. Let's have a look around. I'm sure we'll run into a robot or something. Look at this. Gosh, I wonder what futuristic device this is. Some sort of transportation pod, I guess. I wonder how you get in. I don't see a door license number anywhere. This is very peculiar. Have you ever seen a tree this color? I must say, the future is quite a bit different than I expected. The breeze is so hot and muggy, I figured they'd be able to control the weather by now. The air stinks, too. I guess there's still pollution. Ever feel as if you're being monitored? Or that you're about to do a double take? <laughs> You must have gone back in time instead of forward. What tipped you off, the dinosaur? Don't get smart, Fuzzbrain. Just get in and face the other direction so we go into the future this time. You mean we went into the past because we were facing the wrong way? You think I've got some AAA map? Maybe you'd like to steer this time. We made it! It's a good thing the time machine didn't stall or we'd have been eaten by dinosaurs. We're coming back toward the present now. Do you want to stop at home or keep going into the future like we planned? I've had enough time traveling. Let's go home. Let's just go a little bit into the future and see what I'm like as a teenager. Let's not, all right? Hi, Mom. Hobbs and I went time traveling and visited the Jurassic period today. That's nice. What's it like? Pretty scary. A dinosaur almost ate us. Actually, we were trying to go into the future, but we made a mistake. I see. Well, I'm glad you made it back. Your mom isn't phased by much, is she? It depends. She didn't take the frogs in the toilet so well, remember? <laughs>